have an OnlyFans page, and he's mad because he's just now finding out about it. Of course, I'm mad. I'm just trying to find about it. I'm not doing it with anybody but myself, so why should I have to tell you my choice, my body, my body, my fucking choice? YouTube, my buddy D, it's your boy Steph. Welcome back to another cold video. I have something I want to play for you guys. Before I play, make sure you guys follow me on Instagram at Steph is Cold. It's stupid, yo. I can't believe I'm sitting here just finding out you got an OnlyFans page. Out of all these years, yo, the disrespect that comes with it that you couldn't even talk to me before you did it. That's bullshit, yo. That's fucked up. You still got the nerve to come on here and tell me that that's your OnlyFans page. Yo, that's fucked up. Wait, wait, no, no, no. Calm, but you're not going to say fuck me or that's fucked up. It's not what fucked the fuck up. You're recording me. What the fuck are you doing? Listen, it's not fucked up, and we're going to... Up. Okay, look, so I have an OnlyFans page, and he's mad because he's just now finding out about it. Of course I'm mad I'm just finding but out about it. I'm not doing it with anybody but myself, so why should I have to tell you my choice, my body, my I'm body, brother, my fucking I'm your choice? I'm your partner, you're supposed to come to me and talk to Joe, me. Joe, I've been talking to you about mad things. I've been asking for solutions to shit. You're not giving me none, so I created one. That's no solution. Not in my book. That's no you solution. Knew, you knew who the fuck I was when you met me. Before. Before. Before, before, yeah, we before, met, yeah, I and knew I that. thought that I would never have to go Man, back to already, anything yeah, like I knew this that again, but unfortunately, no, no, no. that's not the case right after now. That, after that, everything's supposed to change. Everything did change. No, 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 no. Obviously, everything. it hasn't. No, it had to. I had Obviously to do something. Hasn't. You stood out there showing your body. You stood out there doing stuff like this on camera. You act like that's the only thing that I do. I have mad jobs, but they're not facilitating everything that needs to be done. So I got something extra. Only fans be breaking me off. What the Man, fuck? Come on, Keith, with that. It don't matter what they breaking you off. It's the disrespect that comes with it. What you disrespect? Even, you couldn't come and talk to me about it. Okay, well, we're talking about it now. Because I had so. to find out on the fly. All right, then. But now, okay. No, so, wait. I had to find out on the fly. So now you know. Yeah, now I know. Okay. And so? Whatever. I've been doing what I have to do, period. Like, that's bottom line. Okay. That's what it is. Let's see what this comment says. To those of you saying he knew her before getting married to her, blah, 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 and so effing what? Where's the respect that comes with marriage? Everything was meant to stop after getting married. <clears throat> a very big shame on her. And this guy right here says this, man. Once a hoe, always a hoe. Never you, wife a hoe. Them nor go near something. I don't know what he say after that. And that's why I want to make this video, bro, because I, I, would, I really want to make this video, bro, because like, you got to catch what she's saying in the video. I was going to tell you. I was going to tell you. <clears throat> nah, bro. She was never going to tell you, bro. See, that's what y'all got to understand about how women operate, bro. Because, you know, a lot of women, they did that to me. You feel what I'm saying? You know, because they was going to tell you up until you caught them. If you would have never caught them, they was never going to tell you people what he said. He said, I had to catch her on the fly. I had to catch her on the fly. And did you see her attitude? Her attitude is, well, well, I got to get it how I live it. I got to get it how I live it. I'm a 304. I guess I got to be a 304. If I'm Joe Smith, I'm out. But it ain't that easy. It ain't that easy. She would, but even without negotiating with the man, they don't have no respect for us, bro. They don't get he ex NBA player. He ain't making them as money as he used to make. They ain't, man, she ain't got no respect for him no more. I'm sorry, that's just the way it is. Where's the respect and the morals? She said, You knew who I was before I met you. We finna blame him for that. Because, you know, sometimes we think that we can change women based off of what they say and what they do. You feel, you feel what I'm saying? We think that they're going to change. We think based off of what they're saying, oh, baby, I promise I'm going I'm to do this, I'm going to do that, I'm going to change, I'm going to change. But then deep down, bro, they still the 304. And it hurts. <laughs> same, with the, same with the females. 
You feel what I'm saying? He a dog, he a dog, he a dog, and he keep on trying to prove to you. But deep down, baby girl, he just can't be faithful to you and monogamous dude. He don't really like you like that. You feel what I'm saying? He don't, he, don't, he don't really get down like that, baby. It's just what it is. It's too much for them. That's that's too much. That's too much to digest. That's way too much to digest. But 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 you know. It's a problem when you don't want your woman or your wife, your wife, the covenant with the most high, your wife. You don't want your wife to be selling her body. Because let's just be honest, bro. Whether your girl is doing OnlyFans, bro, or 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 or, or doing selling feet pictures, bro, it's still sex work at the end of the day, gang. somebody's wife this is a reflection of him so so once again <laughs> Joe's, been, uh, Joe's been wife playing with her playing with her little playing with her little remote controller she playing with that kind of Taurus going crazy uh, she's squirting all over the place damn, damn she's sucking him off going crazy dang that's your wife dang she ours now dang where to respect that dang I can get some of that too damn if a woman is if, if a woman is quick to sell her body, she quick to sell that coochie. And there's nothing that you can do to tame that 304 spirit inside of her. Nothing that you can do. A lot of these women want to be free, but they can't be free because they need the security bars. You can never, ever, never, ever. Ever think that a hoe don't change. Because she always going to revert back to her true nature. Every time. And they could be crying. They can be giving you the manipulation all the whole time. She getting dug out by a whole different guy. Whole time she manipulating you through the whole situation. Your beta simp ass think it's all good in games. You think it's all good in games. Meanwhile, you know what I'm saying? Your girl is creating OnlyFans. Everybody has a price. Or everybody does not have a price. Shit, <laughs> if your girl on OnlyFans, she definitely got a price. So that means the highest bidder is going to win. What if the highest bidder is her type? What if the highest bidder is somebody she want to get dug out by? Baby, I got 10 grand, 20 grand, 30 grand, 40 grand, 50. Ooh, I want you so bad. I dig you out, girl. I got 50 G's right now. You think she ain't going to accept that money, nigga? If she's willing to accept little, she's going to accept it all. But it comes with a price, and she know that it depends on what the, what, what the repercussions is. Oh, not getting caught by my nigga? Oh, that's easy. <laughs> he think I sell it. He, he think I'm doing this, but I'm really doing that. See, it starts it start small. I was going to tell you. She was never going to tell you. You a lie. No, baby, I'm sorry. No account. I was going to tell you. I was going I was to bring it to your attention. Never was going to bring it to your attention. You got to find. You, a woman is never going to tell you. You have to catch her red-handed. You got to be cold enough to really know how to catch a motherfucker red-handed. If you ain't got the eyes to see you blue pill as hell, you're going to be goofy corn. Your goofy ass. So, you gotta understand, bro. Like, your girlfriend, if she has an OnlyFans, bro, that's not your girl. That's our girl. And I mean that shit, bro. Facts. The reason why I say that's not your girl, that's our girl, because she's for sale. She's for fucking sale. And guess what? If a guy is desperate enough, they say desperation meets inspiration. So when a guy's desperate enough and he's inspired enough to want to want to buy it, 
he don't care if he's going to willing to pay for it, guess what, bro? There's nothing that you can do about it. Why be in a relationship with a woman that you don't have full autonomy over? It makes no complete sense. You might as well just dig till she busts, movie, date, repeat. Dig till she busts, movie, date, repeat. Now, there are subcategories within dig till she busts, right? Behind that is building somewhat of a relationship, friends with benefits, leading, maybe you want a relationship, maybe you just want friends with benefits, maybe you want to put her in the rotation, dig till she bust. Movies, you know what I'm saying? Your crib, drinks at your crib, you feel what I'm saying? Drinks at a bar that's, that's, that's close by your crib so you can bring her back to the crib. You feel what I'm saying? Create something nice inside of your, your crib. Make your shit look real nice and decked out. That's the movie. So you got that big ass TV on the wall. Big ass TV on the wall. When a baddie come over, she's comfortable. Movie. Date. We already know what the date is. The date is whatever it is that you want, want you and her to do as an activity together. It can be top golf shit. It could be going to work out together. Shit. It can be um. Uh, a walk in the park, it can be going to lunch, it can be going to dinner, it can be going ATV riding, you know what I'm saying? It can be going jet skiing, you know, it can be smoking weed together. It all depends on you because it's your frame. She's coming into your world. So if you're coming into my world, you have to accept my rules, my boundaries, my laws, who I am as a man. You want to come fuck with me? This is what you have to accept. Isn't that how they do us? Their standards? They won't accept less than it. Well, well, motherfucker, this my standards. And I don't want a 304 as a woman. If that's a fucking problem, get the fuck out of my face. Period. Point blank, period. Well, here's my standards, G. I, I, I don't want my woman to be posting those kind of pictures on the internet for other niggas to see. You're insecure. Well, you a hoe. We even. I'm an insecure. You a hoe. I love an honest one because an honest one, you know exactly what to do with them. You know how to see them. You know for what they are. And they love it because they so fun. But the chameleons will get you. They will get you. And then they will try to they, they will try to make it seem like they're, that, they're not that. They'll try so hard to, to, to be what they're not. <laughs> like I always say, it's only it, I, like I always say, it's only so long she can stay celibate for, bro. They all got toys, so a toy ain't gonna do it for it, bro. Ain't nothing like the real thing. If toys did it, if, if toys just did it for it, they wouldn't have Instagram and social media. Damn, I'm so cold. Fuck. If if toys were just enough, they wouldn't need Instagram and social media and TikTok. They love videos. They love videos. So, but you see them as whole. You see them, oh, my girl would never do that. <laughs> you goofy ass nigga. <laughs> your friend, if you you got a girl and her friends is a 304, bro, your girl's a 304 too. She's just trying to be a good girl in your face. But behind closed doors, she probably the biggest 304 in the group, my nigga. Just being real, bro. Just being honest, bro. And they would try so hard to make it seem like that's not them. But deep down, that's them. I was dating a chick like that. I had to let her ass go. Out the fucking rotation, bitch. Because you a hoe. Can't fuck with you. Can't fuck with you. Because such cause certain things, bro, as a man, bro, you you you, you have the, the honor and the, the, the fortitude and the fucking right to have standards. I don't want a 304. What is so hard about that? You know, it's a problem. They're mad because that is exactly what they are. You know why your girl, oh man, sorry. You know why your girl don't like when, when, you know why your girl don't like when you watch my videos? Because I'm fucking right. Because I'm right. That's why she don't like when you watch my videos because you, you, you look at, you, you start to look at that motherfucker a little different because Everything I'm saying is right. This is why I get niggas in real pure rage. 
because the whole time a woman was doing it and they didn't even know because they didn't have the eyes to see. Now they got the eyes to see and they pissed. Oh, don't worry about how many guys, how many, how many times your woman told you, don't worry about him, don't worry about him, don't worry about him, don't worry about him. He's just a friend. He's just a friend. You ain't got to worry about him. But she want to worry about your hoes, though. You cock blocking ass bitches. I can't worry about the nigga that want to fuck you and you want to fuck him. But every time a bitch want to fuck me, you want to cock block that badass bitch with that big ass and them big titties because you know she'll fuck me. I ain't cock blocking that nigga that want to fuck you because every nigga want to fuck you. You over ego inflated bitches. Every nigga want to fuck you. So every woman don't want to fuck me. So you get... You can sniff on that thick, big booty, big titty, fine ass motherfucker want to bounce on my dick. You can sniff it. That's why. No! No, Flamingo! No! You can't talk to him! That's why you go stalk her and follow her and do all that goofy ass and goofy shit. Because you know deep down I can get that pussy. My bad, fellas. They know deep down you can get that pussy. Deep down they know you can get that pussy. Just like deep down, we know how easy they are. Funny how that works. You get with an easy ass girl. It, man, it was a dude at the gym, that gang, I swear. And, and his girl, you could just tell his girl just want to be free. Ass all out, she just want to be free. But he, he holding on, mate guarding. She, she's supposed to be holding on to you, my nigga. Because you are supposed to have an abundance of options. You're supposed to be that nigga. Not worrying about what the fuck a hoe dude. That's why you gotta always get to the chicken bag. The bigger the chicken bag, the less the problems. That's facts, G. It's only more problems when you're making more problems. We're not worrying about these 304s. Hell, yeah, we ain't claiming them. We ain't dating them. They dating us. They wanna fuck us. They wanna claim us. Claim no hoe. We claim that chicken bag because that's the only thing we focus on is success. Success in chicken bag. Getting to the fucking grind, going to the gym to become that top 1%, that top 3% man, to become that cold man, bro. Not worrying about what some hoe doing, bro. Because a hoe gonna always be a hoe. Ain't nothing you can do to change her. She just gonna feel bad about herself that you caught her. And she might wanna change. That's on her. You can't lose sleep and lose money over her game. Let her go. Chicken bag time. Bad, batter hoes at the end. Oh, it's always batter hoes at the end. That's a fact. That's what they scared of. <sighs> He's going to get somebody better. I'm just going to fuck somebody better. <laughs> He's going to get somebody better. I'm just going to fuck somebody better. I'm going to get him better and I'm going to fuck him better. You see them big ass cheeks moving like, yeah, I'm hitting that. Yeah, she called her and she, yeah, I'm hitting that. Yeah. Oh my God. Get your standards so motherfucking up here that you intimidate every weak ass bitch in your path the same way they try to intimidate us that can make it seem like we weak. Bitch, I'm strong as a bitch and I'm cold as a bitch. I'm nowhere near weak. I'm not one of these lame ass niggas that don't have a purpose that chase yo, yo 304 ass all day. See, they got the game fucked up. That's why we got to get our chicken back up. So we ain't got to be dealing with the goofy ass shit, bro. See, when you got your chicken back up and your money right, you ain't got to be dealing with the goofy shit over there. I promise you, you could just pick and choose wherever you want. Wherever you want. Because the more you show up, the more they going to show up. And the more they going to want to fuck with you because you in their environment. You feel what I'm saying? A woman always going to make it easy for you when she really want to fuck with you, G. A woman always gonna make it easy for you when she really wanna fuck with you, G. You ain't got you ain't gotta try too hard. You ain't gotta do no gimmicks, no tricks, no none of that. The only thing you probably gonna have to do. I'm gonna spit it baby, bro. What's up, man? Yeah, I'm stuck. Nice to meet you. Shit, that's about it, bro. I'm gonna go on from there, gang. Pull up with the utmost confidence. Because you earn every right in this fucking world to get where you at as a man, bro. 
shit ain't given to you. You can't just you can't just exist. You can't just post your booty cheeks, bro. You can't. You gotta be a fucking man. You gotta grind, bro. And you can't worry about these 304s because they gonna waste your time. That's the video for today, my G's. I'm back, bro. I'm fired the fuck up.